Those tier two guys, I mean, they're basically sitting there like, you know, JT, George Springer, please sign to kind of get this thing going because otherwise, I mean, it's got to be frustrating. Absolutely. And, you know, the conversations and the, this is the way they went with me when I was a free agent, clubs would call you and say, hey, we're interested in bringing you in as a backup player, whatever the role might have been, but we have to make, wait to make some other decisions before we can come back to you. So you're just sitting there preparing for a season. You don't know when that's going to start, when spring training is going to start, and you're waiting for the big free agents to start moving so that the market will develop for you again it's a stressful time if you're an older type free agent out on the market you're going to be waiting possibly into spring training whenever that might start it's not a comfortable time spoke to a player agent not too long ago who has multiple clients and he described a couple of his clients as being a little panicky because of what we're talking about right here everyone wants a resolution everyone wants to know where they're going to be Brian Cashman, the Yankee general manager, did a recent radio interview with Sirius XM where he talked about decisions stretching into January and February. I know there are probably folks who are saying, is there going to be a Christmas surprise? Could anything happen before New Year's Day? Will any big signings occur? They've had two months to make some of these moves. Now we're entering into a part of the holiday season where people usually kick back a little and relax. So the idea that suddenly some big signing is going to happen I just don't know that I would bet on that. You know, we all want...